Other than mascots being put in the game, the only other thing I was excited about was the Kareem Abdul-Jabbar post hook finally being in season seven so i thought today we are going to return with the kareem abdul jabbar build test out the most overpowered move that held the scoring record for over 20 years and see how well it does in 2k now in this video we're really just going to be testing out the post hook but i did drop a video a few months back where i tried out all of kareem's moves besides the post hook so if you guys want to go check that out make sure to go peep it also i'll be leaving the link down below in the description to this face creation make sure to go show some love this guy has very original you know face creation just in general for a lot of of NBA players and some celebrities as well so make sure to go check them out so this is the build that I've had for a while it's known as the taco fall build or even sometimes it's called the Yao Ming build but today we're going to be using it as Kareem Abdul-Jabbar as you guys can see we have a 95 close shot on this build so when we get takeover it's going to be completely maxed out our finishing badges aren't completely maxed yet but we do have pro touch on hall of fame which is really all we need and some people were letting me know too that the post hooks that aren't directly in the paint they go for your mid-range rating so I'm gonna rock mid-range magician on silver you guys let me know down below in the comment section is that right because I feel like you have to have a mid-range to hit any post hook that's not in the paint and also this is the build with a 99 block so we have hall of fame anchor now i'm really excited to do this i've been waiting for seven seasons for 2k to finally put this animation in the game hopefully i'm not disappointed but i think it's gonna be a lot of fun if you guys are new to the channel make sure to go ahead and subscribe i think this is gonna be pretty sick it's the most overpowered move in nba history so it has to be good but without further ado kareem abdul jabbar the legendary skyhook let's go ahead and get right into it now like i said i really have no idea how the skyhook is gonna be this year i don't really think it's been that good maybe since 2k 17 or 2k 18 but it still should be a lot of fun and we're going up against the two-way the season just started so you guys let me know down below in the comment section what you guys think about it this might be one of the better rewards for the season like at level 40 i know mascots are kind of overdone in my opinion it probably should have been done earlier in the year but it's still pretty good uh, so let's see if we can just go down here and hit him with a little sky hook to start us off let's see what does it look like oh my gosh dude that is so fast okay i have to get used to that other years it's been really slow so i think we got the timing down now we should be all right so let's try to finesse a little bit to get the sky hook off off. I feel like he's going to kind of be on it a little bit. Okay, why was that one so slow? Was that contested or something? Why was the other one so fast? Oh my gosh, 2K bailing him out, dude. <laughs> Dude, I didn't even jump right there. I swear, Hall of Fame anchor, the higher your anchor is, the dumb animations like that you get. Like, they get so bad. I've never seen that before. Well, the good thing about playing defense is I've only scored two points, but we do have dual takeover. So we should be able to get these hook shots off a lot easier now. Look at that. That should be good. All right, I'll just make sure I can make one. I think I could go a little bit deeper. All right, let's go down this way. Oh, that dude, that is so fast. The fact that that's going in is also kind of crazy, but that's why we have Hall of Fame Pro Touch. What the? <laughs> Yo, what was that? He didn't even mean to do that. I swear he did it. We might have to give this guy the best of both worlds right here. We don't have to do a sky hook every single time. We might have to mash around a little bit because, dude, the way that this guy is playing, I feel like if I turn it over again, I might not see the ball back. Crazy how easy it is this year. They try to add the adrenaline, but the fact that you can just do so many escapes now, it doesn't even matter. Oh, my gosh. Slow it up with the hook. Oh my gosh, the fact that you can just do escapes and run the whole year and use like no stamina or adrenaline, it kind of defeated the whole purpose, I think. All right, let's do this quick. Let's get a quick sky hook. Okay, now we're able to green these. I feel like if I go down into the post right here and escape out, he's going to jump. He's going to jump right there. Oh my gosh, a little hop shot. A little hop shot. Come on. <laughs> we're just really giving this guy everything. I'm surprised he's not reaching a lot more. Oh, that might be all. Oh my gosh, the fact that that went in, that's Hall of Fame Pro Touch. I wasn't even timing that remotely correct. Just bump around a little bit. Oh my gosh, that is so slow when you're drunk, you're tired. But Pro Touch on Hall of Fame, it might be the best badge ever, dude. I'm not timing these right at all, and it's working. We'll spin by you real quick, throw it down left-handed. Let's see if we can do a little bit of a deep post hook. I don't want to get a fade animation, but if we do this correctly, it could be nice for a game real quick. Hit him with a little Asta slide, go down to the post, right back at him. Oh, yeah, that's nice. Oh, yeah, that's nice. With the left hand, the right hand, it doesn't matter. The sky hook this year, it might be the best it's ever been. I'm hoping to go up against another center to see if, like, they can play a little bit better defense like, what the contest would look like on this. But, yeah, it's looking like, dude, this might be a sweat. 16 points a game. He kind of looks like it's tryhard. All right, well, we have to get a stop first. Let's see how he plays a little zigzag. I already, know, I already know how a lot of people play this game. So, I feel like I can play pretty much perfect defense on anybody. Besides that, of course. 
I'm just too slow to react and it just keeps doing walkbacks and rim runs. I have a 99 block, but I know if I step back a little bit more, he's going to shoot it. What's the point of a 99 block when this guy can just square dunk and quick drop me the whole time, bro? Give me that. And we'll go up. Oh my gosh. If I step out right here, if I would have stepped out right there, that's the good thing though. Like I said, a block shot, two rebounds, two points. We have dual take. Oh no, little buddy. Little buddy. You're going to have to play a little bit better defense than that. We have a sky hook. Don't know why I did that. Oh, yeah. That's a good block. And a good throw down. All right. We're not turning this ball back over. This guy takes so long, and all he wants to do is rim run the whole time. I don't even think he can contest this, dude. I feel like him jumping is pretty much nothing. He might just be able to skyhook this whole entire time. I'm not going to lie. Oh, give me a fade animation. That's all right, though. 7%, he's jumping at me. That's the only tough part. For some reason, you can't do a skyhook. Actually, it's probably good that you can't do it from super deep. Just be able to get whatever we want. One right here. Oh, spin bot. Oh, he's kind of got decent defense, I guess. Hey, easy dunk. I, dude, I got to get this build to 99 because that's pretty sick. Oh, the opposite shoulder, dude. Do you see how easy this is to green, too? Like, the last game, I felt like I timed so many of them poorly, but it still didn't even matter. All right, we'll do this right here. A little huh. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, that's pretty. I forgot about the little dream shake, little shoulder fake. Oh, what are you jumping at? We're not going to go up with it every single time. A little finesse there. Oh, he... Oh, my. He blocked the sky hook. I felt like he got it as I was going up, too. That's kind of crazy. Drop step. Easy layup. Easy layup. We don't have to do a sky hook every time. All right, we got to do a lot of finesse here. Oh. Oh. <laughs> That is so clean, but bro, the skyhook animation. If you get a little bit of room, you've got Hall of Fame Pro Touch. Dude, I think you can make every single one of them. Ooh, it looks like we might have a little post score showdown here. He has slasher and post date. Let's see what he's got. Let's test out his post moves. Is he rocking the skyhook today? I don't know how he was just able to do that. No sky hook for him, but he is hitting me with a hook shot. Let me step up. Let me get right here. I do not want to give him slash or and post take. It's probably over after that. I don't have all my badges quite yet, but that still might be good. Yeah, dude, I got to step out here. He probably has takeover. I'm playing really bad defense right now. It might be kind of difficult to get the sky hook off here. I might have to play a little bit of finesse. First shot, green. You already know what time it is. Come on. Another green. Look, we don't have to do the sky hook every single time. This guy's kind of good, and he's a full score. We'll get a couple sky hooks off here. We'll see what we're doing. We'll we'll spin off real quick. Go this way. Escape. Come back into the post. Hit him with a little sky hook. Okay, that's clean. That's a nice move. That's where I think close shot kicks in, but the other ones are definitely mid-range magician or mini magician, I think. Oh, we got 99 block, my good sir. All right, we're anything off takeover. We can just score one more time and have take. Oh, the opposite shoulder. That is so clean. And we got dual takeover. This is nice. I didn't think I was going to be able to get too many post hooks off this guy because he is pretty tall. This. Oh, yeah. He's jumping. He jumped at that one. That was a yellow contest. I want to see what this one was. 8%. That's not too much. Oh, yeah. He jumped again. He jumped again. It doesn't matter. It does not matter. We're locked in now. Dude, I think Ant is actually really an underrated badge. I feel like it pops up every single time I score, too. Especially on builds that don't have, like, handles for days and stuff. Can we hit him with a little Jokic hop jumper? Cheese. A little cheddar. I think we can. Oh, no. I thought we could. Oh, my gosh. Why was that timing so bad? And he does have dual takeover. Jump. Good jump. Oh, I thought that was going in. Oh, yeah. See, bread and butter sky hook, dude. It's actually a very nice animation. It's quick, and I feel like it's super easy to time this year. Oh, that was a nice move. I have to make that. I'm terrible. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right. I did not expect him to do that. All right, we got to get a stop before we lose our takeover. Because if he's going to start rim running us, even though we have Hall of Fame Anchor, 
I don't I don't know how confident I am. No way. All that wiggling. Ah, right, we gotta we gotta end it here. Oh, that's tough. Oh my gosh! 10%, dude. I didn't even time that right. There we go. Come on. One more basket, and we're almost out of takeover. So this is our literal last chance. Oh, yeah. That's off. Oh, and we ran out of takeover. I tried to skyhook from the other side, too. He's almost out of take as well. I might have to use some of my fouls. How is that a great... How does that go in? Gosh, dude, I, found, I don't know why he jumped right there. He definitely should have. Now, right, we got to score one more, dude. I think we can get him with the hop jumper. I feel like the hop jumper is going to be there. We hit him with a little spin. Oh, we didn't get the spin off, but we still can get the hop jumper. Come on, get in there. Need those. Need those. Let's go. <laughs> well, that's a good game to that guy. I honestly thought I lost. The fact that he was hitting those little wiggle threes and still getting those hook shots off, good game to him. That was a fun one. All right, so we're going to get a three and D point now. We should be able to kind of just test out the post hook, I feel like, every single time this game. Honestly, I kind of want to test if we could win just by doing the sky hook. That would be kind of nice. That would be kind of a nice way to end it, just to see if we could do the sky hook every single time to score. Well, will also slide, come back down here. Dude, I feel like if you're just short like that, you jumping is really not going to do anything unless you jump early like that one guy did. I feel like these are going to be open every single time. You want deep in the paint like this. Oh my gosh, like I said, it doesn't matter. 8% contested, it is going in. Okay, I want to go into the paint and see if you can do it. Like, right there, I feel like, is what they anticipate a close shot to be. So, anything that's not right there, I feel like it's not a close shot. I don't know, maybe some of them are, like, layups. Because, like, that timing is definitely not the same as the other one was. All right, enough of this, dude. Enough of this. He thought he did something. We're going to the paint, and we're dunking it down, all right? I'm down. I have to get one to drop. Especially when I take the ball out because my stamina drains so quickly. That makes the post look so slow. All right, look. He's not contesting this one. He's not contesting this one. That one's going in. Escape out of it. Do one of these. Oh, my gosh. What are you jumping at? Hey! <laughs> That's a nice dunk right there. When I'm going down, I was going to do the skyhook every single time. But you know what? When you're playing from behind, you got to take whatever you can. Oh, that creates so much room. I felt like I was doing like a hop shot towards the mid range a little bit. There we go. There's an what? We missed that? I feel like that was like one of the better time ones than other ones that were going in. There we go. That's an easy sky hook right there. How did that other one miss though? I feel like that was actually kind of nice. All right, let's just go down here, hit him with a hook shot. That's all you got to do. Just spin off him a little bit. I don't know. I have no clue where that animation was. But the sky hook, like I've said throughout the video, kind of nice this year. You guys let me know down below in the comment section if there's any other builds you guys want to see at Legend. You let me know what you guys think about the sky hook and all the season seven stuff just in general. But again, if you guys are new to the channel, make sure to go ahead and subscribe. Check out this video when I went to the random wreck with my Luca build. But until next time, this has been your boy Dignified. I'm out. Peace.